have you ever met an astronaut or piloted a Mars rover or drank a galactic cocktail? <laughs> if not, you're in luck. These are all things that you can do this Saturday at Pittsburgh's inaugural Spaceberg Festival in Market Square. And Boaz has been giving us a preview of this brand new event. Boaz, there's a question about Chewbacca, and I don't know. I, I imagine that he won't be there. Oh, Chewbacca, gosh, you know what? Is he? He just left a second ago, but he did have a message for you. He wanted me to tell you, oh! <laughs> so whatever that means to you, just share it with you and your family, I guess. But yeah, we're actually... Mike over here, a human, not a Wookiee, from the Moonshot Museum. There's so many activities happening, and one of the folks sort of sharing those activities is the Moonshot Museum. You're coming down and you've got some experiments, right? Yeah, so I'm from the Moonshot Museum right here in Pittsburgh. It's the only museum in the world where you can see lunar landers under construction, designed, built, and flown by Pittsburghers. We're going to bring a taste of that excitement to Market Square on Saturday. Some space science and space art you can try as part of our Spaceburg celebration. Okay, well, you've got something, some sort of blue liquid in a flask in front of us. So what are we going to be doing here? Yeah, so uh, we're going to be uh, doing some rocket science. I brought some peroxide. That's historically a great fuel for rockets and landers. A little bit of soap and a catalyst to speed up the reaction, okay. uh, which is fitting because Pittsburgh is catalyzing the space industry today. So oh, I see what you did there. I like that. Thank you. And so is this <laughs> part of the space process or this sort of gives us an idea of what it's like sending a rocket up? Yeah, absolutely. We're going to break that peroxide apart. We're going to get some steam. We're going to get some oxygen in the form of bubbles from the soap I added. Uh, and peroxide is something that we've used in everything from rockets to even test lunar landers through the history of spaceflight. Okay, well, let's see what you've got here. All right, here we go. Let's drop in the catalyst and uh, launch our Spaceberg celebration. Okay. Oh, wow. Things are happening. Oh, my <laughs> goodness. Whoa, you got like a little foam snake. We have oh. blast off. <laughs> So what can we learn from this sort of oozing explosion we just witnessed? <laughs> I think what we can learn is that uh, rocket chemistry comes in many forms. Yeah. Uh, it's part of what's so exciting about going back to the moon. Uh, we're going to the South Pole to find ice to actually harness that, not just to drink, but to uh, make rocket fuel and even breathable air. Um, and Pittsburgh is really leading the way yeah. in that initiative. It's the robots from Pittsburgh that are paving the way for people to go back to the moon. So one more reason to look up, I think, and celebrate Pittsburgh's leading role in space. Absolutely. Absolutely, and it certainly shows you that, that space can be a lot of fun. Also, I want to bring Dale back in here because the Moonshot Museum will be here, but also a ton of other folks will be here on Saturday too, right? That's right. NASA, NASA is sending an astronaut, right? We've got CMU, we've got Pitt, we've got the Allegheny Observatory, we've got Mars Robotics Association, Mars New Year. This is going to be a real opportunity for everybody to come and see everybody who's doing something in space in Pittsburgh. Well, I've got one other offer. We've got Kelly from Talk Pittsburgh. She went to space camp. And she, I bet, is, if, is she available on Saturday to come down? Kelly, could Kelly come down? What do you think? Could she sign autographs? It would be an yeah, honor. It would be an honor, Boaz. Please. She says them. it'd be an honor. Okay, we'll get that on the schedule. Oh, I can't wait. This weekend just got that much better. I'll put on my whole helmet. I have a real one. Uh, and I'm so glad that you guys did this experiment because I just saw this. I'm not kidding you. I saved it on my Instagram feed, and I thought this would be so cool to do in the middle of the street in the neighborhood. I don't know if it's so safe cool. to do in the middle do of the street. Outside. Do it outside. Do it outside. Really neat. Make sure to come by your street and do it. Awesome. Yeah. Very cool. Thank you. Spaceberg is this Saturday from noon to 8 p.m. in Market Square, and you can find more information on our website. Just head to kdka.com slash